Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're back, we're back with a new video and honestly, Miley, this look at the Grammys, it's a vibe, it's Tina Turner inspired and I love it. Yes, we're checking out Miley Cyrus, but before we do, I want you guys to go check out Patreon. It's the first link down below. Check it out. This video is going to be fully uncut, unedited. You all know how copyright works on here. Over there, there's no skips. There's also exclusives over there. We're watching a TV series over there. There's early access. There's plenty of perks. First thing down below, check it out and don't forget to subscribe, like the video, do all the YouTube things. I've posted a few Grammy videos already, check them out and check out Instagram. Instagram's on the screen somewhere and my goal is 10,000 this year and I'd really appreciate it if you went over there. It's linked down below as well. Check it out and let's jump into Miley performing flyers at the Grammy Awards. So y'all, I couldn't find the video on YouTube anywhere without it being muffled or low quality. And so I'm on Facebook. So I find it on Facebook and honestly, someone's mother posted this. So thank you very much, mother that posted this. We're gonna just check it out. Oh, I dream that can't be so. Ooh, can we talk about this look? Can we talk about this? Oh, this hair, this, this silver dress. I love it, love it, love it. I'm obsessed. She's giving sass. She's giving cutesy vibes. Her tone of voice. She can perform the highs down with these vocals. Miley. Miley, I love this deeper tone. I love the sassiness and this. Oh, she's owning this. She's owning this. Oh, she's singing. This bitch, honestly, it cuts to Ed and Taylor, but this bitch just said, why y'all acting like you don't know this song? This girl said that, yes, you're in a room full of your peers and you're in a room where you get accolades for songs, popular songs, the most famous songs of the year and you're performing one of those songs and no one is cheering no one is dancing it's supposed to be a party everyone's having a little sip sip of the drinks and no one is singing along and no one's dancing go Miley for calling that out and go Miley for encouraging the crowd thank you for doing that Miley because these these performances at these award shows be so bland we reacted to Dua Lipa and Olivia was sitting in the audience looking bored Miley is encouraging the folks to be singing and dancing. There's Taylor moving. Yes. Love me better than. Not the shimmy. Not the shimmy. Miley doing a little dance. Miley's voice. I would love to see Miley live. I would. I would love to hear this live. I would love to be there. Oh, hey, Kylie. She's doing a nice little hip movement and I'm obsessed. I'm, obs I'm obsessed with this performance, girl. This performance is so fucking good. It's so stripped back and just Miley on stage. No backup dancers, no big pyrotechnics. Miley and Mike and her hips are moving. And I love it. I honestly love this type of performance. She's got great vocal control. Yes, girl. Where are you going with this? Not the Tina Turner. Not that. I'm obsessed. Adlibs girl, Adlibs speaking to him, Adlibs and can we get this on streaming services? I need this on streaming services with the Adlibs, with the extended notes, the deeper tone, the stripped back production. I need this on streaming. I know oh, it's a necessity. It's a necessity. She looks so genuinely happy with the hair shaking. She's dancing how she would dance around her kitchen or her living room and this is just authentic. Oh my god, so authentic. Should I check out Miley's discography on the channel? 
Is that a thing I should do? Should I check out Miley's discography? I've done and this. Oh. Oh. Hold those notes. I'm blown away. I'm blown away. And we're not even done. We're doing this little chicken. I'm calling it the chicken. We've got another minute to go. Where are we going with this dance? Where are we going with this? Miley. We're switching it up. We're switching it up. Hold in the mic. We're giving a rock moment. The graspiness, the grittiness. For Miley. Miley, this is from me to you. Dropping the microphone like that, shaking the hair. This is from me to you, coming from me to you, Miley. That is how you do a performance. Solo on stage. A little bit of production team in the back, a little bit of people helping you out, but you serving vocals, switching it up, taking a very well-known song and making it so different. So, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I'm obsessed with this this performance, probably my favorite. I've only watched two, but this is definitely my favorite out of the both. No disrespect to Dua Lipa, but Miley, that knocked it out. Knocked it out of the park. Back to what the point I wanted to say was, should I check out my latest discography? Let me know down below. Let me know because I know I've reacted to Endless Summer Vacation and I haven't gone back to it, honestly, two or three songs, but collectively I haven't. And any full Miley projects, I've listened to bangers. And that's it. Every other album I've not listened to in completion. I've heard songs throughout the years. So if you want me to check out my new discography and listen to every album for the first time, apart from bangers, let me know down below. And I'm sure I can get round to that. We're currently doing Ariana's discography, but afterwards, I'm going to need ideas. So let me know down below and don't forget to subscribe, like the video if you like this video. Let me know what your thoughts are on the performance, my reaction, and if you did like the video, make sure you like the like button. Yes, I said that, like the like button, as well as liking the video. Don't forget to do all the YouTube things. Check out Instagram, Patreon, all that, and I'll see you in the next one.